23 ABC's Ken Masenchi sat down with that man accused of killing both the mother and her unborn child. And he joins us live now with this shocking confession tonight. Ken? Tim and Jackie, that interview took place right here at the county jail. And what you're about to hear, very disturbing from Manuel Vela. But to understand what happened to Katrina Rivera and their unborn son, Josiah, you have to hear from the man who says he did it all. I'm really God, I'm not lying. Throughout the hour long sit down with Manuel Vela, statements about a mission from the devil in Christ to kill Katrina Rivera were harrowing. She knew the mission at Ham, and she said, She understands. She said, I'm going to die in 2016. Her grandma knew. Everybody was telling him and warning him everything, everything. He's gonna, you, you're going to die by his hands if you don't get away from him. Vela says he knew about the mission since 2009 when he and Rivera first got into a relationship. I tried to let her loose then. I said, I don't want nothing to do with you. I'm going to kill you. I'm crazy. Vela continually said he was schizophrenic, started working with the devil in 2012. From then on, had one purpose in life. If you knew you weren't supposed to be with her, why did you stay with her? Oh, to kill her. So that was your only purpose this whole time? Yes, yeah, kill her. And you made it pretty clear to her that that was your whole purpose as well? Yeah, told everybody, so, hey, I'm, you, you, I'm gonna kill you, right? I'm gonna I'm kill her. Rivera was found dead along with an unborn baby on Saturday after police chased Vela's vehicle through East Bakersfield. Vela says he choked Rivera last Thursday and cut the baby out of her stomach with a razor blade on Friday, hours before the public even learned Rivera was missing. I realized, you know, what I just did was so fun. <laughs> Truly sinister answers to a horrifying murder with no remorse. Did you think on December 12th, 2016, you'd be, you'd be sitting in, in jail? 2016, I pretty much figured I was going to be here. And you're okay with that? If yeah. that's where you're at for the rest of your life? I'm proud of uh, my God accomplishments. Vela pledged allegiance to ISIS at the end of the interview, and he will be in court tomorrow afternoon for his arraignment. Live in downtown Bakersfield, Ken Masenchi, 23, ABC.